Hello everyone. It's going to be a quick video showing Android Auto in a Sync 3 system. So you can see over here it's a C-Max Hybrid 2016 with Sync 3. And we can go into the general system updates and view the current version. And you can see right there it's the version 2.2. So over here, normally you have the apps, and then uh, it doesn't find any mobile apps. Right here, and the other apps is just the power flow from the car. And in Sync 2.2, they revised it for the hybrid electric vehicles. You just have one tap to get to the power flow, if it's just a hybrid. But you can see right there, Android Auto is turned on. And you have the option to enable or disable for every Android device. So you just go back to the main screen right there. Let me just plug in the phone. And you'll see Android Auto should automatically launch. And there it goes. Android Auto automatically launched. So you have the uh, navigation in the far left corner which brings up Google Maps. So here's a look at the map in night mode, just browsing around. Um, you can have it in 2D mode or 3D when you're near the vehicle and you can just pinch to zoom as well. And you'll see just the, the roads and any traffic on the roads or anything. And over here you have the calling, then you have music app, and then that's pretty much it, you can just exit back to the vehicle. So there really isn't that much, no, no, um, not that many third party apps supporting Android Auto at this time for the music, because if you see right here there's an option to select if you had another app compatible. But there isn't, um, I don't have another one right now, there aren't very many apps that are compatible and then you can just return to sync and when Android Auto is plugged in you can't get to like the electric vehicle apps or anything you'll see the apps has been replaced and normally where navigation would be it's just a direct link to your maps or direct link back to Android Auto and while you're in Android Auto Google now takes over for the voice commands in the Sync 3 system. As long as it's plugged in, I'm pretty sure, even if you go exit and and go to like uh, another channel or something, yeah, it always launches uh, Google Now instead of the Sync voice command. And you can't change any mobile app settings. So that's uh, pretty much it for Android Auto on Sync 3. Uh, thanks for watching, and let me know if you want to know want to see any more Sync 3 or other vehicle videos.